Hey everyone! Since picking up the fishing kayaks this season, I have really enjoyed exploring back lakes and rivers and more remote waters, but I do love fishing big water as well um, in popular waters. So I decided to switch it up in this video and I headed to a lake that sees a fair amount of fishing pressure. I have fished here maybe a handful of times in the past um, and uh, decided to get out. I had a few hours to spare and uh, this is how my adventure went. Alrighty, so I'm just making my way out here starting to see some weed growth um, it's pretty scattered though there's some milfoil some cabbage I'm just gonna keep moving along as I know it gets thicker out here and that's what I'm looking for I mean it's beautiful day low wind which has not happened lately and it's hot so these fish are gonna be hanging in that cover so I'm just gonna Keep moving along and try and find some good thick vegetation. Oh, here we go. So I just rolled up to an area here that's pretty thick with milfoil. A little offshore here. Looks pretty good. Just gonna drop my punch rig through this stuff and see how it goes. waited a split second there to make sure. There we go. Fish number one. Nice little large mouth. Oh. There we go. Awesome. I love this offshore stuff here. So I've just cruised around through the weeds until it was nice and clumped up. And in this heat, they're going to be hiding out in this cover and I'm just dropping this on their head. A couple lifts and that goes on. All right, so the weeds have gotten a little scattered. So I'm gonna make my way back over to where it's pretty thick over here. Just work around that. Yeah, it gets real thick here. It's a good canopy for them to hang out under in this heat. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I don't think I got a good hook set. Oh, maybe I did. Oh, <laughs> this one's a little bit better than the last one. Come here. Nice. It's a real nice one. Wow. Oh. Hold still. Hold still. There we go. Wow, that's actually a good fish. <laughs> right on. Oh. There we go. These guys are tucked up in that heavy cover today. And I'm gonna keep pulling them out, hopefully. It's a good one. See ya. Okay. Need a new bait. Okay, let's get back out there. All right, back in that cabbage. So basically what I'm doing is just flipping my bait into these clumps, letting it hit the bottom 
doing uh, two or three lifts and then doing another cast. And they'll often hit it either on the way down, you'll feel that tick, or when you hop it, it'll just stop or you'll just feel that jolt of a bite. So sometimes you bump through weeds and it can feel like a bite. So you get the feel of it after a while, but I typically kind of wait a second before I set the hook just to be sure. If I'm not sure, but sometimes they're hitting it pretty hard. You can tell very easily. Like that. Oh my gosh, this guy's got me buried. Oh, that's, a, that's not even a big fish. It just put me straight in the weeds. So I thought it was a giant. <laughs> That's funny. Just a little guy. But still fun. There we go. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> nice little refreshing splash. Just get my bait all fixed up here. Alright, back in business. Like, little guy. Oh, a little bit bigger than the last one. Come here. There we go. Nice. And that hook is just right in that top lip. There we go. <laughs> I'm just clobbering it today. Alright, not seeing as much for weeds. Just gonna do a little cruising around here. Try and get back into that thick stuff. Actually, while I do that, I'm gonna throw my chatterbait. See if they're into that. Might as well have a hook in the water while I'm looking around. Well, I can see a bit of cabbage poking up over there. Oh yeah, this looks real good here. Just nice and thick. Actually gonna back off it a bit. Don't wanna run right over it. All right. Back to punching. Oh, this looks great. There's gonna be fish in here for sure. So I've got a bit of cabbage and then it goes to some nice thick milfoil. I love that kind of stuff, especially in the heat of summer. Good one. Oh my gosh, that's a freaking walleye. <laughs> that's a good walleye, wow. Okay, this needs a net. Wow. Thought, wow, that's a really long bass. Nope, that's a good walleye, wow. <laughs> Not what I expected, that's for sure. Very nice. Get it unhooked here and I'll show you guys. <gasps> okay, ready? He's about to flip out. Very nice. <laughs> Unexpected catch, but I'm always happy to see a walleye. I do catch the occasional walleye on this rig. I mean, they're hanging out in those thick weeds as well. All right, not much happening. So I'm going to switch it up and start covering some water. The weeds are pretty scattered here, so I'm just running my chatterbait through them and over top. 
see if I can pick up something that way. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, it's got broke off. <sighs> On a pike and he just jumped. Dang. Not cool, pike, not cool. I'm just retying my chatterbait because I really want to cover some water here while I move around. Wow, this milfo that's super thick. So what I'm gonna do is switch back to my punch rig and see if I get some fish. Oh, there's one little guy. I thought I botched that hook set. <laughs> thought I was hitting the weed. Whoa. Quick release. Oh, there's one. Oh, did I miss it? Nope, still there. Swimming up. <laughs> Cool. A little largey. Come here. Wee little guy. There we go. <laughs> Cute. There's one. <laughs> Little guy. Very little. <laughs> That's all right. Still fun. Oh, I just missed one. Shoot. I thought that was a bite. Yeah. <laughs> that one hit on the way down. Nice. Over here. Whoa, not bad. A little upgrade from the latest fish. <laughs> so I was just going along here, noticed some cabbage clumps. Decided to flip in. There we go. <laughs> little guy. Well, this fish is nice and thick. Another little guy. <laughs> it's been a fun day, you know? I only had a few hours to get out here and caught a few fish, caught a few bass, bonus walleye. Not a bad day. Oh geez, pulled up on some cabbage here. I think I might actually finish off my day here because I gotta head out shortly. Well, uh, it is time for me to head back to the launch. Um, I have a super cool fishing adventure planned for tomorrow. Um, so I actually need to head out of town and hit the road. Hopefully I'll be able to share that adventure with you very soon. Um, but today was an awesome day. Only got out here a couple of hours, got into some of these offshore largemouth on these weed flats and a bonus walleye, so that was fun. Um, honestly, any day on the water is a good day in my books. 
So thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, always love to hear from you below and I'll see you very soon.